A popular beach on Pigeon Lake south of the city will look a lot different this summer. A controversial pier at Manio Beach is being ripped out. Some say a part of history is being lost, while others think it'll only mean good things for the lake's future. Amanda Anderson has that story. The heavy equipment moved in to start demolition on the historic pier last Thursday. An upsetting sight Gail Sleds can see from her dining room window. It was our landmark, our signature, signature structure, and uh, now it's going. <laughs> and I'm very upset about it. Her parents bought a cottage here in 1948 when she was just five years old. She has fond memories playing on the pier and is disappointed it's being removed. Boats dock on it, and I think probably most important is that a lot of people fish off the end of the pier. Sleds isn't the only one sad to see it go. It's, it's emotional, it, you know, it, like I say, it's been there a long time. Uh, I took my swimming lessons off the end of the pier. And... Many residents and tourists felt more should have been done to save the pier, but the village says there were more people in favor of it coming out, especially after a consultant said the pier was having an impact on the health of the lake. We were creating problems for uh, the algae and for the weeds and everything else that were beginning to uh, infect the lake. However, Alberta Environment says weather, agriculture, and human activity are also factors. But the village is confident they made the right move. As the concrete was ripped away and the digging began, another problem was discovered. There are uh, creosote uh, logs that were used as anchors for the pier. Uh, probably okay 60 years ago, but certainly not okay today. It's expected to take at least two more weeks to remove the pier. The village says it's been given a strict deadline by fisheries and oceans to have the process complete by the end of the month. Reporting from Mamio Beach, Amanda Anderson, CTV News.